Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Um, so today I have for you a um, Super Tarts haul. So this is from the Wax Wednesday sale back in November in 2019. Um, these particular ones were all 25% um, off and they were sold in lots of blocks. So I think they were like six blocks or something. Um, and then they shipped them as the blocks were um, were made. So it turned out that I ended up having three boxes sitting at my shopmate um, address. And then I combined those three boxes into one and shipped them over. Um, and they arrived this last week. And so all up with shipping everything. Because shipping is like it kills you from... <laughs> shipping it from the US to Australia is ridiculous. But... With the sale and everything that that really helps each clamshell works out worked out to be just under eight dollars per clamshell including everything so um yeah which isn't too bad because there are places in australia that sell them for that much not many but you can pay you know up eight nine ten dollars for a clamshell usually the price in australia is around four to six dollars but um yeah they just don't have the range of cents here in australia so paying you know just under eight dollars a clamshell including all the shipping and everything is pretty darn good so all up with my mum we purchased 109 of them my order is here and i ordered 29 so i'm going to go through my order first mainly for my records um and then i'm going to go through with a bigger video with the um the clamshells clamshells that she bought and there are some doubles so so yeah <clears throat> so first up there were three samples um i've just taken one of the samples and the other two will be in my uh, mum's video that i'll be making so the first one's butterbeer and i i think i have smelled this before cute shape it's a bakery it's a sweet bakery scent so I don't want to spend a lot of time going through and talking about each clamshell because we will be here for hours. Um, so here I'll just show you, let you know what the scents are and then what are the main things that I smell. So Super Colorfragilis Dick is coconut, kettle corn, spun sugar, caramel, apple and buttercream. So all of the ones from the Wax Wednesday pre-order um, were the first ones that she'd done without any decoration. I guess because she was pumping out so many that um, she just wanted to get them out and the decorating takes a lot of time. And I also know that um, she's Brandy, the owner of Super Tarts, is looking at maybe going retail. So she needs to find a way to, you know, um, be sustainable and um, minimise costs and time and all of that sort of thing. So, yeah, I can already smell <laughs> this from a distance. I can smell that kettle corn. Um, and a little bit of that, the caramel. That's what I'm mainly getting from that. Um, Lucy is, let me just um, focus this, sweetened cereal, marshmallows, sugary milk and mac apple. And I'm mainly getting um, an apple, a sweet apple. That's really, really nice. I like that. Um, Auntie M is berry cereal and sugary milk. I was really surprised that most of these came unbroken. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, I'm getting it's berry cereal. It's like berry fruit loops, so that's nice. Um, Impossible Girl is cappuccino, birthday cake, and spun sugar. I think I've had this one before. Yeah, I'm mainly getting just like a bit of a sweet coffee from that. Sarah Jane is lavender, mac apple, and sugar milk. I'm getting the apple first and then the lavender is coming through. That's quite nice, actually. Um, Voldemort is red apple, ocean breeze, vanilla bean, cactus, and sea salt. Oh, yeah, that's oh, that's nice. What am I getting from that? A bit of the apple. Actually, I'm getting a really big mixture of all of those. So that one's a really nice complex scent, that one. Um, Frankenstein is coffee, pumpkin pie, and vanilla wafers. Uh, yeah, it's like the, um, uh, what are they called? Pumpkin pecan waffles. It kind of smells like that. Um, with a hint of coffee. 
uh, violet. I have had this before. That's why I bought another one. Uh, it's peppermint, cotton candy, and blackberry. And from what I remember, it's really good. This is one that um, quite a few of the, uh, what do you call them, the, the actual plastic and the clamshells um, cracked. Uh, yeah, that's blackberry. It's like a sweet back blackberry. And then the peppermint just comes through a little bit at the end. Uh, Ibikaye. So this is iced sugar cookies and pine needles. Yeah, um, I'm getting more of the iced sugar cookie. I'm just a little bit of that pine needles. I'm not really a big fan of Christmas tree scents, but that is a really good blend. Um, lavender, vanilla bean, and marshmallow. This is Stay Awake. Uh, yeah, big on the lavender. It's like that's really coming through that sweet lavender. Um, Granny's is cappuccino, pie crust, and sugary milk, and the sun's just coming down through the the blinds. Yeah, first thing I get is the coffee. This is a sweet coffee. Uh, this is It Wasn't Just a Dream. It's lavender, pink sugar, vanilla cream, peppermint. I have had this before. It's like go to sleep, but with the addition of peppermint. Yeah, and it's just as I mentioned it, um, as I remember it to be. It's really good. Uh, Mantis is lemon curd and white tea. I really wanted to smell this one. So I, I like lemon curd and I've tried something with white tea. Um, so yeah, I'm really curious about this one. Oh, this is really good. It's uh, definitely lemon curd, and the white tea, it's not like a typical tea. Oh, it's really good. It's really strong. Mm, it's like, it's kind of like lemon curd on steroids, I guess. That's the best way to describe that. Um, Gandalf is sweet, sweetened cereal, marshmallows, sugary milk, coffee bean, and vanilla cream. Yeah, I mean... I've, I've smelled a few coffee ones now, and they kind of all smell smell uh, similar. They're like a sweet coffee scent. Nothing really, um, yeah, distinguishing between the the coffee scents. Um, oh, there we go. Uh, Alien is apple cider, vanilla bean, and donuts. And I have tried this before. First up, getting that um, apple cider. Love apple cider. It's mainly an apple cider. Maybe a little bit of the bakery is coming through. Golem is Ocean Breeze, Red Apple, Vanilla Bean, and Blackberry. An awesome combo. Uh, apple first, and then the Blackberry. That's what I'm mainly getting from that, and that's really good. Uh, Borg is Lemon uh, Custard, Red Apple, Vanilla Bean, and Ocean Breezes. I think I've had this before. Oh, what am I getting? Yeah, the lemon. Oh... Yeah, it's kind of like my brain's going, is it lemon? Is it apple? Is it... I think it's definitely... Yeah, the lemon's first. Mainly lemon. Lemon. Like that. Uh, Lucille is chocolate orchid and blue sugar. This one I was really curious about because I don't think I've had anything chocolate orchid before. Uh, blue sugar. Blue sugar. It's a um, like a heavy, musky... Um, may all kind of smell and yeah, that's I like that addition to my collection because it's um, really different to most things I have Stranger things mainly got this because of the show and my daughter loves the show. So hey, why not get the scent? Um, cola cherry vanilla waffle cone and upside down cake Yeah, cherry Cherry's number one with a bit of cola. Not my favourite scent, but again, <laughs> it's got it for the name. Uh, the Omen is Red Apple Vanilla Breeze Ocean. Sorry, Vanilla Bean Ocean Breeze. I've had this before. I really like it. It's like super strong apple, and the Ocean Breeze just ramps up the um, intensity of it. Like it's really strong. Uh, lavender Orange Dream is Lavender Creamsicle. I think I've had this one before. Maybe. Mm, oh. Oh, this is really good. So creamsicles orange, yeah? So it smells like an orange lavender. Really yummy. Um, is that Jesus? Mm. Uh, sweetened cereal, marshmallows, sugary milk, fruity ring cereal, glazed donuts, 
pebble cereal, berry cereal. Far out, man. That's a lot of friggin' cereals. Uh, okay. So it's like Fruity Loops, but it's sort of more creamy. Yeah, it's more creamy marshmallowy sort of cereal. So, yeah, that's the one. I don't think there's been one I haven't liked. Um, office is coffee, sugar cookies, and vanilla bean. Oh, this one's... Look at that. So most of them have been perfect. Again, it's like a sweet coffee. Yeah. Um, pumpkin waffles, pecan, pecans, uh, tray... How do you say that? Tray... Lesh, lesh, cake, whatever that is. Cinnamon, I don't know how to say it. Cinnamon donuts, sorry. <laughs> Tres leche cake. Mm. Mm, pumpkin waffles and the donuts. Yeah, heavy bakery. Good. Thief is four leaves, mac apple, sandalwood, blue sugar. That sounds really, really cool. Ooh. Oh, I like it. Oh, my goodness. First I got the leaves. Now I'm getting the mac apple. And a bit of that sandalwood. And the blue sugar comes in last. What an awesome blend. Brandy, you are amazing at blending. Uh, sea salt, ozone, seagrass, plum, pear, red apple, vanilla bean and ocean breeze. That's silver surfer. Um, I th yeah, I think I've had this before. And I liked it. That's why I got it again. Mmm, yeah. It has a Jaws-ish vibe about it. So Super Tart's Jaws um, scent blend. Yeah, it definitely, definitely reminds me of that. But it's not as in your face as Jaws is. Um, it's, yeah, no, it, it does have a Jaws kind of vibe about it for sure. But maybe just not as like in your face as Jaws is because it's like super strong. Uh, spoonful of sugar is pink sugar, blue sugar, lemon sugar. Ugh. Yeah, it's, um yeah, I've had blue sugar and pink sugar before. It kind of it smells like that. Not sure if I'm really um, getting any of that lemon sugar. It's mainly pink and blue sugar. Uh, go to sleep. Love this. Like, I've liked this for a long time. Lavender, sweet cream, and pink sugar. Yeah, it's just as I... Yeah, it's beautiful. It's just great to go to sleep to. And the last one, Beauty and the Beast. I've had this before. It's amazing. Blackberry and Magically Delicious. I find the Magically Delicious... <coughs> excuse me. It doesn't really smell like much on its own, but... Oh... When you mix it with this blackberry, it's just heaven. It's beautiful and soft, but not weak. Um, oh, it's so sweet and beautiful. It's not a floral blackberry. It's a fruity, sweet blackberry, and that's beautiful. So, yeah, that's that lot. That's my lot of um, uh, clamshells from the Wax Wednesday order. Uh, there's another like 80 that my mum purchased so I will um, yeah make another video and I will try to go through as quickly as I have gone through these but um yeah I like it for my record and also you know if you if you're looking at purchasing certain scents um, especially if you don't like certain scents sometimes it's in it's mentioned that it's in that clamshell but it doesn't really come out as one of the strongest notes so yeah hopefully um yeah you found this video interesting and um i'll see you soon in the next video bye